Namah Shivaya Nithyanandam. Today's class is um, uh, learning for the point of view of a stone which is very precious to my heart which is known as Unakite. Unakite is an aggregate. It is also known as Jasper Unakite. It is an aggregate of three particular stones, Apitone, the green in it, uh, Moonstone, the soft pink that we find in it, as well as the red spotting of Jasper. This is a very healthy stone for people who are wanting to maintain relationships. As a tradition, parents gift Unakite uh, a product to their daughters in wedding. And uh, the reason is because it said that it brings two together to make a third one because this is already a combination of three stones together. It's a beautiful stone and here we have shaped it into Shivlingam and Ganesha. It is very particularly consecrated when I sell these products on my site. It is not to sell them for money, it is also to make them reach the right audience so that people who are having to start their life as a new married couple, they would find value from the stone. The radiation of the stone is going to heal them. Particularly, I'm also wearing a string of unakite, which is um, to deal with the past life, um, si uh, past birth cycle uh, black spots that are left and we need to deal with those emotions. Softly, when this stone comes into our life softly and very passionately, it helps us understand those patterns which are from the past life and we are able to sort them out. And uh, particularly in case of this stone, I have seen wonderful explanations that it gives to one's own self. And we, are, we get the gift of Mother Earth from the use of this stone or just by keeping it traditionally with us. Here, the Ganesha or Ganpati, which is also widely worshipped by all Japanese because almost 80% of the Japanese gods are also Indian gods and uh, luckily preserved by certain monasteries uh, who are professing Buddhism, the old traditional Buddhism, the Zen Buddhism in uh, Japan would also respect this stone very much in the form of Shivalinga and Ganesha. And uh, if I may say this is the fourth largest, uh, fall, largest followed religion, the Hindu religion from where we have taken these two figures. This is a sacred geometry which links us uh, as Shivlinga, the sacred geometry, the style, it links us to the super consciousness and makes us divine beings who we are actually, but we have forgotten the divinity factor in us. But uh, because of this stone's presence and worshiping Shivlinga, we get enlightened. It also helps us open the third eye. Not only third eye opening, it also helps us rise in the factor of Kundalini, which is very important and has been the quest of all seers and seekers since times unknown. So I hope you like this video today and with this I say that in case if you are requiring any of these stones you can link up at our site www.kits9.com or you can also find us in Kits9 store on Amazon.in and we'll be there to serve you. And please do share your uh, messages with us in case if you have any doubts or any questions regarding the Unikite you can always refer us um, on the link given below on the mail. I will be leaving my email ID you can ask me. And if you want to purchase this stone, you know where to get it. Go to www.kits9.com and it would be yours. Thank you.